in terms of how to manage these adverse events with patients, um, it starts off with developing a really highly personalized relationship, making those personal connections with patients and getting gaining their trust and knowing that we're never too busy for them, that they are just as important and no matter how small or minor an issue may seem, it could be evolving into a more significant side effect. So it's always important in our practice, our workflow, is that we appreciate when patients call us. There's a lot of ways where patients can contact their providers and we try to mainstream that because sometimes patients don't always know the significance of a side effect. So um, we, we ask them to allow us to be included in that decision making, of course, so we can ensure that um, we're intervening at early points in time so we can mitigate any severe side effects, limit any interruption in patients' quality of life, their activities, their work lives. Um, we're trying to um, encourage them for opening up those conversations early on when side effects do start. So calling us first thing when they notice there's a change is really our way that we educate our patients. And our patients are usually pretty adherent to that. Sometimes they have to go through a couple times to figure out that they need to get in touch with us maybe a little sooner. But um, we really gain their trust knowing that we're very responsive to them and sh demonstrating that we're very available um, and that that we will intervene very quickly.